This week, I built the most painful LEGO alarm clock. First, I needed to build a catapult to launch LEGO bricks into my face at 7 o'clock in the morning. This is pain factor number one, and it turned out to be extremely painful. To make the catapult actually work, I added some rubber bands and a stopper so it would fling a bunch of Legos into my face. Then to trigger it, I built a release mechanism for the catapult. I programmed it to be triggered using this Lego sound sensor, so when the alarm clock goes off, the sound sensor gets triggered and the motor rotates. I then made a simple code to do that. Anyway, then I started adding pain factor number two. A drawer of Lego that would dump on the floor after the alarm goes off, so you'd have to step on Lego as soon as you get out of bed. I used a simple gear rack and motor to achieve this, and I even built a gear ratio so the drawer would move really fast, and that way the pieces would spread out more on the floor. Then all I had to do was build it up to look way better, add some cool designs and colors, and finally test it. And I can honestly say, it worked fantastic. By the way, this build was inspired by Liam Thompson's World's Worst Alarm Clock video. So shout out to him for giving me this idea.